what I got for Christmas, what Santa Claus brought me. Hi, lifestyle lovers. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Erica. My channel is called It's E Lifestyle, and it's all about creating a good lifestyle. We have some new lifestyle lovers to the channel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. This is a lifestyle channel. So on this channel, I share everything from home decor, unboxings, cook with me's, clean with me's, mainly home decor because of course that's my passion. But it's pretty much unrealistic for me to decorate every single day or every time I turn the camera on, I really, really would love to do that. And I'm actually um, working on something for 2020. It's too soon to share with you guys, but hopefully I will be able to incorporate decorating part-time into my life. I'm hoping to do that. So as things progress, I will share that with you guys. But today's video is going to be what I got for Christmas, what Santa Claus brought me. So I only have a few things and I just wanted to share it with you guys. I'm loving everything that I have. And it's, it's, it's just really amazing how small things can make you really, really happy. So without further ado, let's get started. Guys, the first thing that I got for Christmas, my daughter bought me is the Shark lift away pro steam mop and i actually did a unboxing on my channel and a demonstration um of this mop I'm, I'm loving it so far i've only used it once and it has several attachments so this shark lift away steam mop is good for steaming clothing items it's good for steaming your stainless steel appliances so it's actually good for multiple things. The only thing that I have used used it for so far is mopping my floors and it did an awesome job on it. So I'm loving it. The main thing that it used for is it works. And also I used it to steam some curtains. I don't know if I was doing something wrong or if the curtains were too thick, but it didn't really do a good job on the curtains. Um, but I have a heavy duty steamer for that. Here is the mop. It um, came with one pad, and so all of the details are on my unboxing video, so I will link that below. But my daughter bought me this mop, if I haven't said that already, and I love it. I don't love the clean, but I do love the mop. So these are one. this is one of my items I got for Christmas, and I actually asked Santa to bring me this, and my Santa daughter brought it. So if she's watching, thank you, Neri. Mommy loves the mop item that i got for christmas was this bayou classic aluminum 10 quart 10 quart fry pot with perforated basket and this is good for frying chicken frying fish seafood whatever in large sums so you i just recently purchased the propane tank my sister bought me this and it says deep fried chicken, shrimp, french fries, onion rings, hush puppies. So you can do it in large sums. You know, if you're having a party or something like that and you want to fry something opposed to frying several batches in a frying pan, you can fry it all at one time. And she know that I just recently purchased a propane tank. And so she also, she also bought me a, um, what is this? A tong? A tong to get the crabs because one time we cooked crabs, a crab reached out and pinched me, y'all. And I was bleeding, I was crying like a, well, I wasn't crying, but you know. So this is for them crabs, the mean crabs. I got something for you. Here in Florida, we love us some crabs, y'all. So I eat crabs at least once a week and I am the number one crab pot cooker. So yeah, she brought me this because I didn't I didn't have any tongs and I think we end up going to get some that was cheap or whatever. So these are real heavy duty. They're made by, I don't know who they're made by, but you can just, they're not cheap. And she also brought me a basket. This is made by King Cooker. So if I just want to dip in the frying pan without getting too close to the heat, I can dip the shrimp out or dip the fish, whatever. We can use this for the crab pot as well. So I'm gonna tell y'all, when I first got this, 
I was happy. I was excited. But I was like, wait a minute. This ain't really for me. And my sister was like, yeah, I thought about that. So I got you something else. Because my house is like the house that my girlfriends, my family tend to gravitate to. You know, I'm one of the single ones in the group. Semi-single anyway. And, you know, so I don't have a man lurking around listening to this good, good girl talk. And, you know, we could just come over here and let our hair down. So when I thought about this, I'm like, this this one I cook for y'all behinds. But, yeah, she, she, she did think about that. And she bought me something else, which I'm going to share. And I love that as well. I guess when my sister thought about that, the other gift is not technically for me. It's a hosting gift, but it's for us or for them or my girlfriends. She brought me something else, which are some pajamas. And when I tell you these things, they just got out the wash because I had them on for two days, y'all. But they so comfortable. They are so comfortable. She bought them from Victoria's Secret and I didn't even know where they came from until I got ready to do this video. So it's just a leopard, it ties. And it has like the, um, what it is, the skinny bottom. And so I was, I slept in these. I ran to Walmart in these. And it's not just pajamas. It's kind of like crop top. It's cute. You know, it shows a little cleavage. I'm going to do a little, you know, I'm going to have to try these on for you guys. Because I don't know if you can tell, you know, just how cute they are. But, um. Yeah, I love these. They're comfortable. Sleep in them, run errands in them. You don't have to change into anything new. So I'm ready to get in these tonight, y'all. So this was another item that I got for Christmas. So the next item I got for Christmas, guys, were some Dolce & Gabbana tennis shoes or slip-ins. They are called Sorrento. I have been watching these shoes for a while, so I looked at them. And I was like, eh, no, you know, kind of expensive. And I went back and then I looked at them, I looked at them. So I have been pretty much stalking these shoes. And so Christmas was the time to get them. Santa brought them. They are the Dolce & Gabbana Sorrentos. Um, I had to go a size up. I don't know if you can even see them on just get, you know, they are gorgeous. So they have the... Dolce, they are the, uh, I don't know what kind of crystals they are, but it has the Dolce, Dolce on one shoe and Gabbana on the other. And um, before I purchased them, I had been reading the reviews and they were saying that they run really small. You may have to go a size up, a whole size and a half. But my girlfriend, she went down to Miami um, right before Christmas and I told her to, you know, check in the stores and see if she could find these shoes and try them on to see um, what size, you know, what size I would need. So she said that they ran about a half size big. So I wear a seven and a half. This is actually an eight. They are really, really comfortable. I wore them on Christmas. I got so many compliments on these guys. I love these. It definitely is a high ticket item, but I will say this, if you're gonna splurge on something, splurge on something that you really, really love. So I think this is something that I'll still wear two to three years from now and that I will still be loving two to three years from now. And one thing about these, they make a statement themselves. So you don't need a real expensive outfit. You can, I think I paired it with a, um, sweater set that I purchased from Express. You don't need a lot because these shoes right here, they say it all. Last but not least, I got the iPhone 11 Pro for Christmas as well. So this is, of course, the accessories that all iPhones come with, which is the charger cord, the headphones, and the, you know, USB thingy or whatever. But um, I guess you guys are wondering, where is the phone? <laughs> I'm recording on it. I broke my camera again, guys. If you're new to this channel, I was doing a decorate with me probably about 
two months ago and my camera went crashing down. The lens got stuck. And you know, I, I had insurance on it, so I had to ship it off to be fixed and ship it back. It happened again. When I was recording the 2020 um, home tour, and I think I recorded, I had to record over, over, over. <laughs> and I still, it still wasn't completely perfect, but anyway, I broke my camera again, guys. So I'm recording on my new iPhone 11 Pro. So let me know how the quality is because, you know, I'm like, okay, back to filming on my iPhone. I go, when I first started filming on YouTube, I started on my iPhone until I purchased the Canon, um, mark two whatever gi mark gx mark two i believe but yeah so i love my iphone it's really really small i did not get the pro max but i had an xr before so it's it's smaller than my xr so every time i pick it up i'd be like this is small i have to remember you know that it's an upgrade but maybe i should have got the pro max but i really don't like a large phone but I guess I'm just used to having the XR, you know. So, so far, um, I'm loving the iPro. It takes amazing pictures, which is really one of the reasons that I upgraded. My son got an 11 for Christmas. So, you know, I decided to upgrade to the iPhone Pro and it really takes amazing pictures. That was my number one reason for wanting it. I, you know, it, it was my gift to myself. Okay, lifestyle lovers, that's pretty much it for what Santa brought me. That'll be it for this video. Make sure you subscribe if you're not already. I have some amazing content coming up. I am actually filming from my office and I am planning a tour of my office really, really soon on the channel. I know I've been saying that for a while, but I really mean it this time. Today, I received, I need to get my TV mounted. And today I ordered the white mount from Amazon because I have a white TV in here. So I ordered the white mount from Amazon and my brother is going to um, mount the TV and I just need to get the carpet clean, but that's it. Um, I It's not completely finished, but it's finished enough for me, for me to, you know, share it with you guys and do a tour. Please let me know what would you like to see from me, especially my new lifestyle lovers. I primarily focus on home decor because that's that's my passion. That's my that's what I love to do. But if you have any ideas or any content that you would like to see from me, please comment below. Let me know. And I also like to know what did Santa bring you? Did you get what you want for Christmas? <laughs> my face what are you talking to i'm talking to youtube is she seriously asking y'all asking y'all what y'all got for christmas i seriously am not bad i'm talking to the lifestyle lovers are you a lifestyle lover uh, look what team apple brought her get out of here bye she's rich guys i'm not rich but get out of here and look what look what look what else you want. close my door <laughs> Look what she bought. I told him you got an iPhone 11. Stop. Bye bye. Close my door. <laughs> make sure you comment. Make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Stay tuned for the next video. Happy New Year. I'll see you on the next video, lifestyle lovers. Bye. <laughs> Boy, you crazy.